IT Maid has learned the state is now paying more than $50,000 per acre for land in Boone County. And the state plans to spend $120 million to secure land for a huge new development. IT Maid's Richard Essex reports. The city of Lebanon is on the verge of taking in close to 1,500 acres through voluntary annexation. The state is betting big time that the millions of dollars coming to the area will pay in jobs and eventually tax revenue. The, the remaining property, our vision is to continue to attract additional investment. A few dozen property owners have signed agreements to sell their land for this proposed development. This field just north of Lebanon is scheduled to become an interchange for a portion of that development. Eli Lilly and Company is in negotiation with the state to purchase 600 acres for a new manufacturing facility. The development was initially cloaked in secrecy. Landowners were getting offers to sell their land, but there was little information on who was buying and for what reason. Mark Waski of the Indiana Economic Development Corporation explains. We want to make sure that um, you know, we're developing partnerships with those in the area and not uh, coming in and, and doing something that they wouldn't want to um, happen to, to their land. So um, any property that we're acquiring is from willing sellers um, and, and those that um, are comfortable with um, you know, providing the land to, to the state for this type of development. The state is paying $55,000 or higher per acre. I can't say uh, with specificity as, as to how high it went. Um, but, but it, again, was something that we negotiated in, in best faith for Indiana's taxpayers, but also for landowners in the area, too. The proposed development will eventually consume 7,000 acres of Boone County. The county commissioners are in the process of putting together a planned use development ordinance. The ordinance would limit and define the type of industry and companies coming into this development. Uh, taking into account the types of uses that the state would like to see located there, but again, keeping in mind that there are other folks in the surrounding community uh, that would be impacted even if it's not their land directly. Waski says the proposed development is getting some attention for companies looking to expand. I asked the mayor of Lebanon, Matt Gentry, if future development means additional annexation. Well, I say that if future annexations, you know, might happen, potentially, right, but nothing's been nothing's been fought with the city at this time, right? So we're only considering these, you know, 1,450 acres. The Lebanon City Council is expected to vote on the second reading of the annexation on Monday. In Boone County, Richard Essex, Switch TV, IT Mate.